One of the most common questions I get is what kind of bass strings do you use? And you know, over the years, I've probably tried every bass string on the market in one way, shape or form. So I've tried round wounds, ground wounds, nickels, coated strings, flats, stainless steels, and everything in between. As you can hear from that first track, what I'm looking for in a set of bass strings is a fast responsiveness all over the instrument that creates a cohesiveness while adding the right amount of glue to complete the overall acoustic blueprint. I've recently got involved with an Italian string company called IQS Strings, and I gotta say I'm really digging the overall harmonic frequency response that these strings deliver. They just seem to get a more even feel across the fingerboard and for a lack of a better description, just seem to be a bit more in tune with themselves than many of the other well-known brands that I've tried. Check out this soundbite where I'm playing a funk groove using what I think is a killer combo, my Mura MB25 string and IQS nickel wound strings. Another great thing about these strings is you can order custom sets as standard orders that include different gauge sizes as well as different scale length sizes. So if you have a 36 inch or a 32 inch scale length bass, IQS will be able to fill these orders immediately. Personally, I use the standard 34 inch scale length and the gauges that I prefer are 45, 65, 85, 105, and 125. I'm currently using their nickel round wound strings wrapped on a hex core and I'm really impressed with them because most of the nickel strings that I've tried in the past I find a little bit dull. For some reason these nickel round wound strings seem to have a much broader harmonic frequency range. Check out how these strings pack a powerful punch to this slap groove played on my Lakeland Daryl Jones 4 string with a John East J-Tone preamp. A lot of great bass players are starting to get on board with these strings, including Federico Malaman, Andre Goucher, and Lorenzo Feliciati. If you want to check out these strings, then just click the link in the description box below and head on over to their website. And if you have any questions about bass strings, please leave them below in the comment section. Until next time, practice smart, work hard, and play creatively.